check out that purple heart contrast in the back. And that diamond light. Daisy, small daisy, like the fall astronauts. This only blooms during the fall. Hey guys, so uh, I was just showing you guys some of the fall aster that I had in the in the back corner of the house. I went and got another small plant, just like that. Another fall aster. You can see by the blooms here. It's the same plant. I'm gonna put this over here. This plant grows like a like a uh, like a small um, ground cover. It doesn't get too tall, but it does spread really well. And so I kind of wanted it to spread in this back corner a little bit. I don't have a lot of things back here. I have a little bit of uh, Turk's Cat, smaller versions. Uh, but this particular fall aster spreads really well. And I want to put it back here in the corner and see how well it does. This area gets um, um, part sun, um, lots of shade sometimes uh, during the fall, but uh, I think it'll still do well since this plant blooms uh, predominantly in the fall when it's, it gets, you know, some sun back here. Uh, so I'm gonna go ahead and uh, start planting that. My daughter's gonna film me real quick. It's a really small plant. I'm just gonna take it out of its, out of its thing here and I'm gonna use some of the, the dirt that was already there and just kind of cover it in. And then I'll use some of the fertilizer that I have to kind of get it going. But I've already pre-dug the hole covering it up really good and uh, I'm gonna get some okay. fertilizer and spread around it after I fill it in here with some of that compost that I already dug up. Now I'd like to know if you guys like this particular plant and how well it does in your yard. Uh, so leave me some comments about this fall astro. I'll, I'll post a reference on this fall astro um, uh, in the description, okay? I've uh, got it all in now. Uh, thank you guys for watching. Uh, and uh, see you on the next video.